Hello everyone welcome to my channel, please subscribe and keep watching for more details. Gypsy Rose shares first consensual intimacy with Nick Ryle. Gypsy Rose Blanchard has been in prison since she was in her 20s. Following her release, what did she say about her first consensual intimacy with her husband? Keep reading for all the details. Why was Gypsy Rose Blanchard jailed? Gypsy Rose Blanchard has been making the media rounds after her prison release, but some people still aren't familiar with her story. When she was 23, she was charged with the murder of her mother. She enlisted her then-boyfriend Nicholas Gojan to kill her mom while Gypsy waited in another room. When the body was found, the police initially thought Gypsy was kidnapped and missing, however she was quickly found and confessed to the crime. She took a plea deal for 10 years in prison, but was released early for good behavior. Her ex-boyfriend received a life sentence for the slaying. What makes the public interested in Gypsy Rose's story is the years of abuse she suffered from her mother. Claudine D.D. D. Blanchard convinced her daughter and the rest of the world that Gypsy was battling several medical problems, including muscular dystrophy and leukemia. Once Gypsy Rose realized she wasn't ill, her mother allegedly turned to physical abuse to keep her bedridden. Gypsy Rose married in prison. Gypsy Rose met her ex-boyfriend on an online dating site. Their relationship ended when they both went to prison for murder. Her story caught the attention of Ryan Anderson, and he wrote her a letter in prison. She wrote back, and the two corresponded via snail mail. They got married in 2022 against her father's wishes. Shares details on first time with husband. Despite being married, Gypsy Rose and Ryan didn't get any spousal conjugal visits when she was behind bars. Bachelor alum Nick Vile hosted Gypsy Rose and her husband on his Vile Files podcast earlier this week. The former prisoner spoke about her first intimate encounter with her husband following her release. She admitted that she was nervous, especially about her body. I have scars on my body. In prison, it's not like you got to see me before he married me. They say you gotta drink the milk before you buy the cow, and that didn't happen for us, so I was extremely nervous. Gypsy Rose confessed to Nick. However, it didn't take long for her to feel safe with her husband. After her mother's death, Gypsy Rose became close with her father and stepmother. According to BachelorNation.com, she plans to get a matching tattoo with a special meaning with her stepmom. There's this symbol, and it's called a unalom. Basically, it's a little squiggly line that basically means that the path to enlightenment and self-awareness is mixed with twists and turns, but it doesn't make it any less beautiful. What do you think about Gypsy Rose? Are you tired of the media coverage of her or do you want to hear more of her story? Let us know your thoughts in the comments.